My name's Elijah. Where I'm from, you have to have more than one hustle. I'm a barber, recording artist, magazine CEO, rap battle league owner, a father, a husband, businessman, among many other things. I also go by many names, but for now you can call me Beer God. I'm also a big wrestling and sports fan. This is my new podcast where we focus on different subject matter. So tune in to the Beer God Presents the Subject Matter Podcast. You are now listening to the Subject Matter Podcast, hosted by Beard God. Listen, like, comment, and don't forget to subscribe. Beer God Presents the Subject Matter Podcast. On the line today, we got Mr. Avenue C, the activist with activists. What's going on, brother? Avenue on the building, man. You already know, man. West Philly. True indeed, man. So... Let me ask you this, man. What has life been like since the I Have a Dream punch? <laughs> uh, I mean, it's been, it's been, it's been the same for real, for real, man. Only thing that's a little different is like it's a lot of uh, niggas be on some hating shit, man. Mm-hmm. Uh, Clout chasing or whatever like that, just seeking for attention, trying to start a crowd for no reason. Uh, I, I ain't really a fan of it. You know I, mean? I, I, I ain't really know how to uh, handle that shit at first. Mm-hmm. You ain't coming from where I come from. Like, you just can't talk crazy to somebody. Like, yeah, you yeah. just think it's man or rap or whatever you think it is. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I feel you. I feel, I feel you. a lot of love, though. Like, I feel, I feel the love also, man. You, you, know you have a lot of people reach out to you? Yeah, a lot of people reached out to me, man. I had people, uh, Inboxing me saying I'm a hero from all all over the uh, world. Mm-hmm. They're saying like they appreciate what I did, man, and, and me just standing up for what I stood up for, like. Yeah, you know, I, I know it is like every couple days, like somebody comments and says that. You know what I'm saying so you you, you kind of are looked at like like a hero. You know what I'm saying? Um, this is why I, this, this is my personal question that I got for you. Have you ever thought about doing stand up comedy? A little bit, not not too much, man, but a little bit. But stand up comedy kind of different. Like I know I'm funny, and I know like me battle rapping and me having to come up with material. People, I know I can do stand up comedy. Mm. Coming up with material and stuff like that. Mm. It's just I don't know if that's my my, my lane though. Like I don't know. Mm. I ain't never really think about doing it, mm. but it did cross my mind a couple of times. Like, I mean, I think it's something that I think it's something that you could do. And I think it's something that you could do, and I think it's something you'd be good at. You know what I'm saying? Because you got the you got the sense of humor for it, and and, I, and the fact that you know you battle rap, it kinda is like 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 experience as far as with the writing. You know what I'm saying? Because you understand how punchlines work and stuff like that, and then by you being a battle rapper, it puts you in the pos- in the position to be able to work crowd control. You know what I'm saying? And I think if Everything lines up the right way, and, and and you get it together. I think if you if you pursue it, I think it's something you be you will be uh successful at. You know, with me, it's all like I don't know. It's all about like where I'm at in my life right now. Like battle mm. rap, I've been battle rapping for a minute. Mm. Like with comedy, say if I was to do comedy, like I would feel like I feel like I would have to be like in a certain space in my life, like and, mm. and comfortable. Mm. I don't think I'm comfortable to be like standing on stage just joking and shit like that. I, I, I see what you're saying. Yeah, yeah I, I could definitely understand it. I could definitely understand it. Now, um, no, I want to say one more thing about that too. Like, and with the uh, battle rap and comedy shit, I would feel like I would have to probably like have to study, like study comedians and shit. Like, I mm-hmm. I got comedians I watch, but for me to really do it, I would think I would have to like really fully understand like mm-hmm. what they was doing there and how, okay. how to approach it different ways and all that. Yeah. Yeah, that's, that's understandable, man. Man, holla at OC Diesel, man, because he could definitely give you some tips. But um, OC well, definitely needs some tips out there. And yet, and yet, and your squad, it's a bunch of y'all, and everybody brings something different to the table. Everybody has a different personality. Um, yeah. my Leading question it. is, my question is, who is like for you? For you, if 
you in the gym, if you need advice, you need somebody to talk to, who's the who's the go-to guy in your team? The go-to guy? Like like the first the, like the the first one you gonna pick up the phone and call. Yeah, you know I'm saying. Jeez. Jeez, the flare. Jeez or TD. Okay. I don't know. Like that's a hard question, man. Cause I would call White too. Like none of them niggas answer their phone though. So. <laughs> <laughs> but it it probably would be between Jeez and TD. Mm. Okay. I'm now, gonna go. I'm gonna go with TD because Jeez ain't gonna answer. They just said, they said, "Jeez, they bears the fault." Yeah, don't don't be in a position where you need bell money. Don't call that dude. <laughs> uh-huh. <laughs> All right, man. Next question, man. What league has been your favorite to battle on, and which league has been your favorite to watch battles on? Say it again. Which league is my favorite, and which league is my yeah. Watch it on. Yeah, which which league which, which league is your favorite league to battle on? And then which league is your favorite league that you like watching battles on? Um, uh, which is my favorite league to battle on, man? Uh, I it's a tough one, man. I'm gonna say I'm gonna say the league I had the most fun at, man. Okay. I'm gonna say that. Uh, what I like watching the battles on which league I like watching the most, including smacking all them. Yeah, any league. Uh, that's a tough one, man. I fuck with all these. I be watching. I be in the crib just watching leagues. All type of battles, <laughs> man. Yeah, I'm, I'm a student of the game, lads. I be really just watching people and shit like that. Um, damn, that's a horrible man. I'm gonna say, I'm gonna say, uh, Sigu, man. That's what I'm gonna say. I like watching Sigu battles. Oh, salute, man. That's what's up, man. That that, ah, yeah, man. That's love right there. Now, what shit? Um, what you you got? Um, you, you got three favorite Sigu battles. Like, there's, there's a lot of good battles on that general, man. Um, all right, let me narrow it down, man. I'm going to go with me, Avenue C versus Cleezy. That was a good one. I'm going to say uh, J Murder versus Stampede. I like that general. No, matter of fact, not J Murder. Yeah, you mean drugs? Somebody be like, J Murder didn't battle uh, uh, Stampede here? I like that. Oh yeah, stamp, yeah. Stamp, stamp, stamp and drugs. Yeah, that was TC uh, seven. Yeah, I like that battle. Drugs are stamping on that job. And uh, E Heart versus Stewie Newton. I like that. Battle. Yeah, that's one of my favorite Jones, man. That's that's that battles in my um. That's in my sick you top five battles of all time. It's the highest viewed battle on the channel. I actually, salute to both of them. I recently just interviewed them. Um, so they, they episodes will be dropping soon. Um, we, one year anniversary from the battle and, you know, it, it did a lot, you know, it did a lot for both of them. Um, it, it did a lot for the league. You know, we proved that we can get two good quality names, um, and, and, and put them together and that, you know, we can put together good quality battles that are on the level of the URLs and the RBEs and the King of the Dots. Um and we small, you know what I'm saying? We, 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 right there, man. Yeah, man, like that that battle could have been on any any of those leagues I just named, man. Dope battle, right. dope battle. Um, yeah, her surprised me with that John. Like she was in there fighting with him. Stewie, Stewie surprised me. His angles he took. I, I like yeah. that battle a lot. Man. Yeah, it was a real good battle. I think she, I think she got under his skin in the third. <laughs> I think she got under his skin in the third. Cause you gotta remember, like. It's different when y'all see these people versus me because y'all see them at the event and then y'all leave and that's it. Like, right. if I booked them and they out of town, like, I got to take them to the hotel. You know what I'm saying? Like, like, like I'm hanging with them. You know what I'm saying? So, yeah, I, I remember the conversation in the car after the battle. Not saying he was like, 
he, 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 yeah, like like his body language, like I, like that's my man, man. But I, I think he know he got edged in that battle. I think that, mm-hmm. I, 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 yeah, I, I give him his props because his rebuttal game was nice. Because I was like, damn, I don't know how he gonna rebuttal this shit. And he rebuttaled it, and it was it was facts and what he was saying. Like they both made interesting points, but I just kind of feel like more people are gonna probably side with with uh. I have, I can watch with her. It probably watched it like two or three times i think i had a different one each time yeah yeah like that third man that third was deep because he, she came at him in a way where he was he wasn't supposed to be able to fight back and because he can rebuttal and because he can freestyle right. like like it it, it 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 did his purpose but i just think that he didn't have the energy to match with the rebuttal. If he had the energy to match with the rebuttal, then I think that he could have he could have walked away with with, with uh, that round. But it's a dope battle, man. Um, on another note, you know you you've been battling for a minute. Um, you got the most viral moment in battle rap history, the top of the year. Um, I don't. Yeah, shout out the shout out the uh shout out the WW. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> um you know. Wolf on Broad Street, salute to him. Um But my thing is this. How do you how does Avenue C want to be remembered in battle rap? Yeah, that's a great question, man. And, and I don't want to be remembered for punching that idiot in the head. <laughs> I want to be remembered for my bars, man. Just being like, being memorable, being, I mean, just somebody you can fuck with when you, when you see him mm-hmm. or whatever. That just a thorough, uh, just a thorough nigga in battle rap, mm-hmm. along with my bars. You know what mm-hmm. I mean, I, I don't feel as I feel as though like there's not too many people like bar wise that can really stand with me for real. For, like, I think I can give anybody a run for their money, mm-hmm. and and I know I can adjust. With like the, the opponent, mm. sometimes you might run into somebody that, that could do something that you wasn't ready for. Mm. You know, adjust for it though. Like when I was in Baltimore, I had a battle in Baltimore against this uh, young boy named Young L. Mm. We went, he went real hard. I didn't expect him to go hard like that, man. I mean, he took the first round from me. He had me, had me uh, my first round was kind of fucked up because mm. he, he went too hard and I was playing. You know? And it just showed me, like, damn, I thought I was ready for everything, but I wasn't. Mm-hmm. Whatever. But I feel as though I adjusted cool after the, uh, the first round. Just his first round. I know he took the first round from me. I thought I was going to clean sweep. All right, now, now um, I'm going to wrap this up with this. Last question. Who are five battle rappers, no matter the tier, you know what I'm saying, no matter the lead, that are on the Avenue C kill list? Um. Uh... You want to put me on the spot, man? I got to mm. put my kill list out there. Hey, man, listen, man. You never know who listening, man. Let's see. My kill list. I have my kill list down to a T. Mm. Let's see. Let me see. I'm going to start off with this name. Easy to block, Captain. You got to see me uh, down the road. We got we have a, uh, we have a talk. Uh... Remember these motherfuckers. Uh, I gotta holler at Geechee, man. I'm gonna talk. Um, Black Rolex. I want battle. You want battle Black Rolex? Yo, that's. I like that. I like that battle. I like that battle. I, I like. Oh. Yo, I really like that battle. Like, I would set that up. I like that. I like that. You and Black Roll like that'd be a goodie. You be, you be talking this street shit, man. I'm trying, I'm trying. I want to battle everybody that can. That's kind of like in my lane in the street type time that that can push my pen in like, and I have to deliver a different way to beat them, like how I've been delivering it. Mm-hmm. Uh, what's the boy name? Um, Gunpowder Pet. Mm-hmm. Battle him. And my fifth will be my fifth. Mm. I know I got it for sure, 
I'm gonna I'm put. Should, I, should, I, should my fifth be a top tier? Or, or, or don't I mean, it's your list, bro. You know what I'm saying? I'm not gonna tell you. Uh, I'm not going. I'm, I'm not. I'm not going. I'm not going to tell you. You know who you should. Uh, who you should <laughs> say or who you shouldn't say. I mean, that's that's on you. This is what the people want to know. This is what I want to know. Like, I'm just interested to know who who's people that you want to battle. Right. I'm mad. I ain't got my fifth, man. But let's. I'm gonna go with a. Uh, I'm gonna go with Reed, Reed Dollars, man. Just because Reed Dollars? Yeah, just because Reed put his name down in the city, man. And I and I would I would love to battle somebody that's been from, from from back in the day that's still doing anything right now. That's a goodie, man. That's a goodie. That's a goodie. But I think out of out of that out of that out of that list, out of that three is I got my kill list now. I got my kill list now. Like it's three people that I've never really thought about battling. Until just now that I put it on there, I can't remember who I, I I got them wrote down. I can't remember the other three officially was, but, but yeah, I rock this list. I kill all the guys. Mm. Mm. Well, listen, man. Who would you want to say was the uh, the uh, the battle, the best battle at the show? Uh, oh, I, I like the Black Rolex, John, man. Like I, I never thought of that battle. Like I, like I, I, I would have never thought about that. And the fact that you, like, as soon as you said it, I can just I watch, see it. Man, I'm crib just watching battles, like, and I be looking at niggas like niggas be garbage, man. So when I see somebody that's like, mm -hmm. like hot to me or they doing like, I feel as they like, it's believable or whatever mm -hmm. like that. I fuck with them, whatever mm -hmm. like that. But yeah, I be in the crib watching battles, man. There's a lot of people I, I know about who probably gonna have to battle eventually. You I knew, man. Oh, 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 oh! I I know who I want to see you battle. I want to see you battle. Uh, I want to see you battle. Uh, now that you brought up, uh, what's the name? What's the guy? Black Roller. Like, that'd be dope. I want to see that. But yeah. I also would like to see you battle Arsenal. I think that'd right. be a good battle. Arsenal from yeah. from New York. Uh, uh, Kali Kali Bull. From um, Coliseum yeah, Battle League, yeah. I've been told him he gotta die because of his name, man. Anybody? Oh yeah, and Ed, Ed got my name. Mm. He got my name. Any type part of my name, you gotta gotta see me down the road. Mm. Down the road. Yeah. I'm, I'm willing to I'm willing to put my name up against all them guys. Whoever loses, you, you said you ready to sit there. You 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 ready to sit there and and and, and, and battle. For the net, that's crazy, man. Hey, listen, man. I'm, look, <laughs> we 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 I'm go. What's it? We, <laughs> look, man. If, if we set up a battle, if we so, so you trying to tell me if we set up the battle with you and Ars and Ab, you willing to battle him for the name? Ars and Ab has no way of being in the battle. Oh man, that's serious. Of course, serious, I would man. put my name up against him. That's serious. That right there is serious. Or uh, shark, shark life Ab. Any of them guys. Oh man. Listen, I'm man. Coming for it, man. I wanna be remembered, man. I really wanna be remembered as the best that ever battle rap ever. That's how I really wanna be remembered. For real, for real. Yeah, man. But I'll take I'll take the Mount Rushmore. Yeah. Yeah, that man. Yeah, man. Let me what's the name, man. Cause I I'm I'm about to start <laughs> thinking I'm about to start thinking of some other matchups, man. I'm about to like I'm supposed to be in in podcast host mode, I'm getting ready to start shifting over the league owner mode. But uh, look, get the people. Listen, man, get the people, man. Your social media, man. Let them know where they can find you at. You can uh, follow me on uh, Instagram underscore Big Trap on Instagram or Avenue C West Philly Finest. That's my other uh, Instagram page, having to see West Philly's finest. Mm. You can follow me on, fa on Facebook, No Love Chapo, or Avenue C. Got two different pages. And on uh, Twitter, you can follow me, uh, underscore Trapzilla. All right, true indeed, man. Listen, man, this right here is the beer guy. We had Avenue C on here, the activist with the activist. And shout out, shout out, Push Your Pen, shout out, Jay, shout out, DJ, man. Yeah. Man. Building, man. This yeah. virus ain't, ain't, ain't doing nothing but uh, slowing us down for a minute.
Yeah, man, and 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 be on the lookout for his upcoming battle, man, on that um Siggy Terminus card, man, against Black Moses is about to be about to be crazy. But we off here, man. This right here, once again, is the beer guy. Make sure everybody that's listening, make sure y'all um y'all like, y'all comment, y'all subscribe. We trying to sit up there and get them um them viewers up. We appreciate all the supporters. That have been supporting, commenting. Just make sure y'all continue to do that. Follow me on Twitter, BeerGuy856. We out of here.